welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today I'm going to show you two different ways that you can personalize golf balls. Okay, let's get started. First, I created the golf ball template by inserting a shape click there and then I uh, unlock the box and the dimensions are 1.68 on both sides. And I changed it to be white, which it really doesn't matter, but I like to. And then you're going to drag your image um, onto the golf ball and you'll click arrange, send to front. And then you'll adjust the image um, how you like. And then we're going to go ahead and hit make it. And make sure that you hit mirror because it's going to be an iron on. So we need to mirror the image. And let's get started. After I weeded the iron on vinyl image, I applied it to the golf ball, secured it with heat resistant tape to make sure the image wouldn't move while I was ironing it. I used the mini easy press on the second setting so it wouldn't burn the image. I also ironed directly on the image. I did not use wax paper. I went over uh, the image or over the image on the ball for maybe 10 to 20 seconds, not staying in one place. Depending on what iron or vinyl brand you use, your time may be different. I have another video on my channel where I use regular vinyl to personalize golf balls. So I haven't had any issues with the image coming off, but I decided to add a coat of Mod Podge over the regular vinyl to seal it to help avoid the, Im the image from falling off in the future. So far, so good. If you feel better sealing the iron-on golf ball with Mod Podge, you can do that as well. I use the iron-on vinyl for the white golf ball and I use the regular vinyl with a coat of glossy Mod Podge on the yellow golf ball. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial today. Tell me what you think about this project and if it's something you could see yourself making. I would love to hear what you think. Leave a comment or if you have any questions. I read all my comments and I will write you back. As always, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video.